What's up, YouTube? I'm Vino511, and this is Vino511 TV. And the question of the day is, who so, is the corniest nigga? The corniest nigga. And why? And why? We'll get to that in a second. Got the game. Ray J. Nick Cannon. Bow Wow. Safari. Um... I'm gonna stay just right up the top. The first person I'm gonna eliminate off this list is probably the game, because a lot of you people out there wouldn't have that same energy if it was in the game's presence. So I eliminate the game. Um, second on the list to be eliminated, you gotta eliminate Nick Cannon. Um, Nick Cannon, you gotta respect his work out there, and. At the end of the day, he's a man. That leaves me with the last three. Ray J, Bow Wow, Safari. Gotta respect Ray J. I mean, gotta respect Ray J. Ray J ain't supposed to be Ray J. Like, Ray J is Brandy's little brother. So, for him to make something of himself now and have the type of success that he has gotta respect ray j um so that leaves me with the last two you got bow wow you got safari this is tough like um of these two these are notorious notoriously corny dudes um Granted, like this always goes to, you know, what I say, like, it doesn't matter how much money you've made or how much success you've had in your career. You can still be a cornball ass nigga. So out of these two, the champion goes to, I'm going to make my own sound effects. And fuck up my camera angle too. Safari. Gotta go with Safari. He's the least talented out of all of these people that I just named. Like, this is someone who, you know, is an aspiring artist, never has, you know, success in the music industry, and um, basically got famous off of being the boyfriend of one of the biggest female rap artists of all time. So, with that being said, the award goes to Safari. And that's my opinion on it. So if you guys like what you've um, seen today, um, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button. Show your support. You rock with me, I rock with you. It's your boy Vino511, and I'm out.